down on the wait time for Maryland vets who need health care. The solution is another place for veterans to turn, and Maryland vets will get that choice thanks to a new local partnership. Yeah, the Maryland VA is teaming up with Evergreen Healthcare, and at its core, this is all about reducing wait times for new patients. Here's 11 News reporter Rob Roblin. For Maryland veterans who are waiting to be seen for health care, some good news. I've waited about six months to eight months, six to eight months. We have all heard about the problems at the Veterans Administration when it comes to providing health care in a timely manner to our veterans. Now, in an effort to get that under control here in Maryland, a new program for new VA patients. What we're trying to do is make sure that the uh, primary care patients, and particularly the new primary care patients, uh, have access through either the uh, Baltimore Hospital itself and also the, the clinics, or they can go into the civilian sector and they can go into our partnership or to our partner, which is Evergreen Healthcare System. Dr. Peter Bielenson is the founder of Evergreen Healthcare, and he says his company will be able to provide services at their four locations. We have a true patient centered medical home, which means we have primary care docs and nurse practitioners. We have licensed clinical social workers to do behavioral health, substance abuse, PTSD services, um, as well as health coaching. We have care coordinators to make sure that referrals for specialty care back at the VA is done. So we have uh, ability to serve virtually all the needs of our veterans. Dr. Bielenson says Evergreen's new facilities will be able to provide all the needed medical services many veterans require. And after making an appointment, they'll be able to receive those services in a couple of days. Passed along to our appointments person who will ask them where they're, which, which center they're closest to, Rotunda, White Marsh, Greenbelt, or Columbia, and be able to make an appointment for them within a day or two. Rob Roblin, WBAL-TV, 11 News.